Hey guys, and welcome back to Red Dead Redemption, the undead nightmare. When last we left off, we liberated the farm, the McFarlane farm. Uh, it didn't go overly smoothly to start with because we encountered the, uh, well, the zombie glitch, or should I say the, the NPC glitch with the missing heads and arms. Uh, which, from what I've actually just looked up online, because I did some research, apparently it's a extremely common bug. So, that's something that we're going to have to be keeping an eye out for. However, so far, a quick restart of the system seems to have returned everything to normal. <laughs> never mind. Never mind. As long as all we have to do is reload, we should be fine. Can you turn up? Can my week get any worse? Hey, now. Nice to see you too, Miss McFarlane. Oh, I thought you'd be dead. I heard things were bad in West Elizabeth. Sure. <laughs> but it'll take more than an apocalypse to take me down. Amen. What are you? A demon or a cockroach? Both, I fear. How's your father? Fine and dandy. He should be coming out of that barn any moment now. Daddy! What's he doing in the barn? <clears throat> Mm. What was he doing in the barn? Just rounding up the undead and keeping them safe so the rest of us can go about our business. Um. He's a real man. He's probably playing around with them. Daddy, stop teasing me! Uh, that doesn't so bode well. Now. How long's he been in there? Not long. Only since. A yesterday. demon or a cockroach? Yesterday? I better go have a look for him. Would you, John? I think you we had better. Call out to me if you find anything. Yeah, I I'm do. kind of fearing the worst, Miss Farlane. McFarlane? Yeah, McFarlane. Hmm. This is lunacy. Right, okay, Mr. Drew. I certainly am fearing the worst right now, so we're going to equip our tomahawk. Um, what the cheese and biscuits? Oh God! What the hell is going on over here? Not on my watch, you zombie bastard! Really? No one else was going to help you? Sniper rifle ammo. That's not too bad. There's worse people I could be doing this to. Lady, I just saved your loopy ass. Alright. Well, I guess we're not going in the front door. That makes sense. Uh, I've got a bad feeling about this. I have a feeling Mr. Drew might be uh, among the dead, should we say. How the frick do we get in here? One would have thought it should be... F ah... Fairly straightforward. I guess we're not going in that way. Can we... Ah, we can get up here. Aha! Uh, yep, that'll work. Clear the barn of undead. Oh dear. Well, that's not exactly great, is it? No matter. Oh god, that really freaking hurt. That hurt, that hurt. Oh man. Mistakes have certainly been made. Mistakes have been made. Mistakes have been made. Mistakes have been made. <sighs> right, there we go. That's better. Right, let's go chop some necks. Hey, buddy. There we go. Feel better for that? Um. Drew, are you in here? There he is. Right on cue. That is a nice rifle. Okay, put down Drew McFarlane. Yes, You're good at dead, it will be done. Sorry, Mr. McFarlane. You were a good man. Yes, unfortunately, this is what happens to good men man, in these uncertain times. Uh, 
You as well? Alright, I'm coming. Oh god, uh, looks like we're a little bit late. You should always carry a gun. Yes, you should. There's no excuse not to be packing heat. No excuse at all not to be packing heat. You paid the ultimate price. Sorry, I'm just sorry I couldn't get That's here quicker. Revolver bullets, what have you got? Shotgun ammo, not too bad. Uh, Bonnie, I believe your name is. I've got some bad news for you. Looks like Daddy is uh, just fertilizer now. Well, John. You always do bring sunshine to my life. I try. I'm sorry about your father. I'd like to say he died doing what he loved. But he never was one for eating folks. Mm-hmm. Slathering from the lips and howling at the moon. I guess I'll content myself with saying that he died protecting those he loved. Well, that's accurate. Indeed. Well, take care of yourself, Bonnie. You too, John. Be seeing you, Miss. Walk softly and carry a big stick. Well, that was unfortunate, for sure. Anyway. Ooh. Someone's... Someone's screaming. Someone's screaming somewhere. I don't think this place is all that secure, you know? People seem to be... Dropping like flies around here. Well... Ooh, hello. What's this? Status unknown. Alright, well. Let's head out over here. Looks like we've got another town to save. Seems like a reasonable thing. To do. Looks like we are. Repairing at least some of the damage we did. In our old days. Our old cowboy days of looting. Nothing to be proud of. Nothing to be proud of. Let's go. Come on, Sparkles. Our time here is done. Careful now. Like everything's clear so far. We haven't found many of those Ravenger guys. What are they called? Scurriers or something? Roamers? Haven't found too many of those. Definitely need to put more of them down anyway. And I also think it's time we start looking for a horse. Ooh, Thieves Landing. Oh. Looks like things are a little bit live here, aren't they? Um, cheers, buddy! <clears throat> you utter ass. Just running me down. It's okay, I forgive you. Oh, wow. Oh, yes. Let the bodies hit the floor. Uh, John. John, see that woman there? Not that woman, but okay. That was close. That was extremely close. Seth, finally I've joined. Well, they true. Oh, hello. Hello, love. No, 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 no. Off me, please. Um, love, please do not chew my neck. Now, ordinarily, I would be flattered that you'd be taking such an interest in me. 
However, given the fact that you want to eat my flesh, and not in a good way, is there a good way? Probably is a good way. Can you get your weapon out, John? Is this another bug? Let's switch to the rifle. There we go. Now switch back to the somewhat. Okay, cool. Right. Sorry, ladies. But trust me, it's better this way. Now, a big pile of corpses here. Corpses means ammo. Or at least it should do. Hey, buddy. I'm sure you was a nice sort back in your uh, living days. It would appear your living days are far from over now. Far from over? At least they're over. There we go. And you. And again. You have a very resilient neck, young lady. I don't like my zombies having strong necks. I like it when they're weak and fragile. That will do nicely. Oh man, this tomahawk is relentless. I'm a huge fan of this tomahawk. Why else would we want to use anything else? Kill the remaining undead. Let them come. Come on, you bastards. Uh, John, that's not how we chop next, John. That is how we chop next. And that. Buddy. Seriously. Look, it's one thing having a lovely young lady chew my neck. Quite another thing to have a dude do it. I'm sorry. I just don't swing that way. I'm flattered. Maybe even a little curious. But that's as far as it's going. So we've got one zombie left. You know, it might not seem like a lot getting a bullet here and a bullet there, but it certainly adds oh, up. Shit. We're getting loads of ammo. Any gifts from the other side, mister? There's always gifts from the other side. Right, Blackwater has come under attack. Ah, shit. So we need to go all the way back to Blackwater, I'm guessing. I feared this day would come. The town is saved. Check back with them periodically to ensure their safety. Yeah. Uh, there's a big wall around this place. I don't remember this big wall, but then it has been many years. How the heck do we get in there? Can we jump onto this, perhaps? Should be able to, but no. Unless they're in that building. Which actually looks quite likely. Oh, they're above us. Hey, guys. Don't worry. I have the cure to what ails you. It's called a tomahawk. And it's hungry for your blood. Chop. And chop. We got fire bottles. You can explore with less threat of being attacked. I like the idea that we can explore, but without threat of being attacked, but I'm not really sure there's a lot of point. Alright, I actually thought we had more ammo than we do. Our handgun's quite healthy now. Right, I suppose we've got to go all the way back. I know somehow we can quick travel. Although I'm not 100% sure how we do that. Ah, can we tr quick travel from our bed? That sounds plausible. Well, this town is certainly a mess as well. Everywhere's on fire. I mean, honestly. How did you burn everything, guys? Now, where's my bed? I'm really hoping we can quick travel. 
Travel to destination. Cool. Um, Farling. Right, next. Travel to Blackwater. Yes, we can. Excellent. Hopefully this place doesn't get retaken over. I think that's the other thing when I played it before and got annoyed. From what I remember, I didn't realise for a very long time... Oh, well, okay. For a very long time, I didn't realise that we could quick travel around. But once I discovered that, that changed everything. Now, Sparkles seems to have abandoned us, at least thus far. I think in the next episode, guys, we're going to try and find a new horse. I'm not 100% sure how we do that. I might look it up. How to get the horse of the, po of the apocalypse. Fireball's nice, but I prefer our tomahawk. Oh, God. Careful. Careful. Right, okay. There we go. Hey, guys. Looks like you have a severe zombie infestation here. And we were almost foiled by a stack of wood. No longer. Oh, hello. Man, I love the tomahawk. Man, I love the tomahawk so much. Hey, buddy. There you go. Feel better? Well, we have discovered the best and most useful weapon in these dark times. And who would have thunk that the Indians would have come up with it? They were ahead of their time with their weaponry. Apart from the lack of guns. Oh, man. Okay, apart from the fact that John is quite literally retarded. And doesn't know how to face his opponent. Oh, God. I didn't actually want to throw that. Come on, John. Come on, John. There we go. There we go. Kill the remaining undead. Yeah, we will. Can we get our tomahawk back? Yes. Yes, we can. Although, I'm not sure if we just got a lucky roll there. Or we did actually get the tomahawk that we used back. Oh, they're on fire. This pleases me. This is lots of entertainment value to see a zombie burn. Very satisfying. I think it's the smell of flesh. I think that's what does it, you know? This is how is this revolting? This is how we get free ammo. Free ammo is best ammo. Stay dead, please. There we go. That wasn't too bad. That wasn't too bad at all. Actually, I suppose whilst we're here, where did we last find that? Um, it's up here somewhere, wasn't it? So if we quick travel, and then have a little look around, maybe, just maybe, We can find us a new mount. Now, I've got to try and remember how you tame a horse now. I think you lasso its neck. And then you've got to jump on the back. And you've got to stay on by balancing. <clears throat> but I can't remember how we actually balance. I'm pretty sure it's just a case of wiggling the analog stick. But I might be wrong. I suppose we're about to find out together. How far through the game are we out of interest? Uh, journal. Is it stats? Yeah, we're almost 20% through the game already. Hmm. I think it is going to be quick. And bearing in mind that's like out of the 100% um, completion thing. I don't know if I want to go for 100% completion. I'd be lying if I, if I said I wasn't extremely tempted. Now, let's travel. And we want to travel to... Is it that one? 
Was it that one? I think it was there. By tall trees. Because that's where he spawned last time. And I'm not sure which one exactly it was. But we really need to get the ball rolling. No, this is the wrong place. However, I think it's close. Yeah, it's closer. Right, come on, Sparkles. This should get us close enough to have a little bit of a search around. You're not Sparkles. You've changed colour. Sparkles, how did you do that? That's impressive. Right, let's... Yeah, so it's around tall trees then. I don't know if they spawn at a certain time. I guess we're just going to have to wander yeah. around and find out. What's frustrating is we did actually see him once. Or it, really. Tall trees, here we are. So somewhere around here. Sadly, we were on foot the first time, and he bolted. Which? What are you eating, buddy? Let's have a look. What you got here? I guess there's plenty to go around. If you be wanting some too. You're eating human meat, my friend. Yep, a little bit of whiskey to soak it in, and I reckon this will be good eating. Uh. It all started just after the plague hit town, you know. My brother comes home shot up real bad. Well, looks like we're eating human meat. Says he don't want them red eyes to his <laughs> soul. Said he wanted me to do it, you know, to kill him. You are a very sick Just man. Put the pillow over his face. But the thing is, you see, I was real hungry. Mm hmm. I couldn't go on. exactly go outside the store, so I cooked him up in a stew and I ate him. He tasted damn good. Hmm. Sounds reasonable. Uh, I don't think John agreed that he tasted nice, but, you know, each their own. I'm not going to judge you, buddy. This world no, is. This world is kind of strange enough without us judging each other. Come on. I guess fresh human meat is the only meat we're going to be getting around here. So, you know, why not? Bon appetit. It would be wrong to judge. Now, if I was one of the horses of the apocalypse, where would I be? We should get a little marker on the map. Ooh. What's that? Is that the guy that we just spoke to? Come on, come on. Looks like it might be. But why is his marker still there? Is there still something we can do to him? we still do something with you, bud? We can sit at the camp, but I don't know what that does. Are you going to tell us another story about how you murdered your brother and cooked him? Well, well he's going to try it again. Another hunk of human meat. <laughs> well, I'm a fan of the sound effects, John. Sparkles is not impressed though. Well, if that's the worst thing that happens to us today. It hasn't been a bad day, has it? Um, tool trees. I wonder if it's done by the time. Let's take a slow walk up here. See if he spawns. 
We're just going to leave that chap there. Maybe the zombies won't bother him, considering he's been eating his brother and all that. Or maybe if the zombies turn up, he will offer them a nice, nice hunk of brother. You never know. Maybe he'll eat the zombies. It's certainly possible. And who could blame him? Come on, Sparkles. Let's get out of here. Come on. Definitely not seeing any blue yet. I don't know what the criteria is that we have to um, achieve. get these guys to spawn. Almost. Almost went right over the edge, didn't you, Sparky? The hunt does not go well. We might actually be in the complete wrong place, you know. Which would certainly suck. Let's go. This definitely doesn't look good. Not a Sasquatch in sight either. Careful, Sparks. You almost went in the water there, buddy. Now, I don't Whoa. think you can swim. Should be able to swim, but I don't think you can. Now, was it here that he spawned? I don't think it was. I think it was further down. I think it was closer to tall trees. There's plenty of herbs and things around, but <clears throat> it just doesn't... Ooh! Close. Close. Yeah, there's plenty of herbs and things around, but... Like I said, I don't think there's any point in us actually harvesting them. At least for now. Maybe we'll come across like a witch doctor or something. It's going to want samples of all the animals and whatnot. That I could see. Unless we can get something that attracts them. That's possible. Yeah. Kind of like you can get bait in the main game. Right, back around tall trees now. And it's getting dark as well, which isn't great. Unless there's o it only like appears once, and if you blow it, you're kind of screwed. That would be unfortunate. Although I don't think the game would do that. No matter how frustrating that might be. Well, I can hear zombies. Unless that's that fella eating his brother. Which he could be. Yep. I can't... Oh! Who's this? Holy crap! Right, let's actually try and save this guy this time. Right, let's do it. One. Two. Three. Four. Nope, that was the wrong guy. Five. Right, let's switch up to the Tomahawk. Alright, we got this. We got this. We got this. Come on, buddy. Try not to die. No, I definitely do not give up. Giving up is for losers. Yeah, we can. We've already got them, guys. We've got this. We've got this. There's loads of you here. Oh, that's not good. 
Yeah, if you guys could not shoot me, I would be eternally grateful. Uh oh. Run, John! Run. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. I think. Hey, we won! I mean, of course we won. Hey, guys! Oh. Did they not give us anything? I don't think we get anything. Travel safe. You down like a lame and stay away from anyone groaning. Yeah. Good advice. Oh wow. 18 shotgun ammo. I think that's what we got for saving these guys. Cuz we definitely didn't pull for that out of someone's pockets. You bastards. You bastards. Who me? Why have you not gone with the rest of your friends? No, I can understand. You're having too much fun out here. Am I right? You, you can be honest with me. A fireball. Nice. Right, guys. Well, I'm actually going to end this video here. Um, I'm going to look up this horse and see if I can find him. Um, failing that, we will continue uh, our missions in the next video. So, thanks for watching, guys. And as always, till next time.